Hey guys, my name is Scott Daly with Pep Hill Animal Shelter. We're here with Lotus today. Kay Sherman um, came out with the name, name Lotus, which is a flower that actually grows from the mud, which was really sweet. She's been with us for about three months now, doing really well. And she was brought to us, she had no hair, she had a severe infection. Dr. Mead's been treating her at our clinic, Pep Health Affordable Vet Care, and she's been doing very, very well. I have a wonderful staff here at Pep Pal. We have about 10 people that take care of her every day, volunteers and staff. Um, our veterinarian, again, Dr. Mead, has been her primary care taker as far as um, veterinary medicine goes. But as far as the TLC part, that's been our employees and administering the medication. We've been doing a great job with that. And as you can see from the before and, and now shots, she's done really, really well. She's very playful, which is much different from the, from the beginning. She slept, you know, for like two weeks straight most important part was we tried to get through the infection that she had. That has now cleared up and we have started on her skin now. And um, as you can see, she's doing really well. She's been on that for two weeks now. We're treating her for um, Demodex. Well, she's gained about 10 to 15 pounds. So she's, uh, and also with growth, but she's done very well. Just with um, proper nutrition, being fed every day, three times a day, and getting the proper medication, she's thrived. We actually started socializing her right, well, about a month ago, we started socializing her, and now we're doing it more and more every day. She's with other dogs. Um, we've done cats, but the kitten she does very well with. A couple other kids that come into the shelter she's been hanging out with, they're doing very good. Even the bird, Quincy, at the shelter. Uh, we're trying to do everything we can to make sure that she stays happy, healthy, and not too excitable, and makes a good house pet. She's a wonderful dog and she's thriving right now at Pet Pal Animal Shelter.